Today, I'm going to teach you how to start your online coaching business. And it's not as hard as what everybody is telling you it is. Hey, I'm Mark Nelson. I'm a former public school teacher, business owner. When I was getting ready to retire from teaching, I started thinking, well, what am I going to do? Because I just didn't want to sit around and do nothing. I wanted to help because that's what I've done all my life. And the funny thing of it was, in a period of two days, on social media, I had three friends reach out to me and say, you know what? You should be a coach. So I started looking into it. Now, two things are going to happen. When you first start thinking of becoming a coach, some people are going to tell you you have to be certified. You do not have to be certified. I've taken three different coaching courses. I am certified. I'm starting to take another one. And the only reason I take them is to make sure that I'm helping people the right way. And that's the exciting part of this because what you're doing is just helping people. So let me talk to you about how you can start your online coaching business. First thing you need to do is you have to think about who do you want to coach? I mean, what's your niche? are you going to be, there's actually three niches, health, wellness, and relationships. Health, wealth, and relationships. <laughs> so are you going to talk about health? Do you want to help somebody lose weight? Do you want to coach people on how to get six-pack abs? Do you want to coach people how to have a healthy lifestyle? Or do you want to coach people how to build a new career? How to become a coach? How to create courses or do you want to help people through their relationships like a dating coach and believe me there's tons of them out there and you don't have to be an expert in any one of them and let me relate to that because as a teacher here's what we would do many times in teaching in my teaching career a principal will walk in and say we need help we need you to cover this class from now on and I'd be starting the next day. Well, guess what I would do? I'd stay one or two days ahead of the kids. And that's the same way with coaching. Now, it's a little different, but the same thing is you don't have to be the expert at everything to coach somebody. You need a framework. So, okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're talking about how that you can start your online coaching business. One, I want you to think about what kind of niche, who do you want to help? And write it down, write down different ideas. The second thing is who's your client, your target customer? Who do you think you want to talk to? Do you want to talk to single moms? Do you want to talk to dads? Here the key is usually your target market, your person you want to talk to is you in your past. See, here's how I started in business. I was a teacher living paycheck to paycheck, right? Doing well. Lived in a small town, but my kids were getting ready to go to college and I couldn't really help them. And it bugged the heck out of me. So I started searching for a way to make money online. That's who my target market was initially. It was me in the past. Somebody trying to help their family create enough income, a side hustle, not a part-time job, a side hustle, so they could stay at home. So that's all that is. Who is your target market? Who is your target client? And I'm good. guess what? I got some uh, freebies that will help you discover how to do this. It's really easy. Um, but I'll give you some ideas on how to build and what you got to do. So find your niche, find your target market or your ideal customer. Now the next one, what type of coaching programs are you going to offer? First of all, I suggest have a one-on-one, -on -one. meaning find a way that you can talk to people and price yourself. And how here is what I need you to hear. When people pay, they pay attention. So I give free sessions. I'm going to offer you a free session down below. 
But the free session is really you talk about your needs and to kind of talk to you about see where you're at and see how I can help you. But if you continually to lowball your prices, say you're going to give coaching calls at $50 each, you know what? Those people really don't pay attention very much. But if you have a $5,000 course, let's say you have a course that's $5,000 for six months, three calls a month, right? So it's $1,000 a month, three calls a month. So your calls are almost $300, $400 each. Those people that come on board with that, guess what they want to do? They want help and they're going to pay attention. So you can help them with the five-step plan. I'll talk about another video, five-step plan, about how you can help them build their business or get over some things in their life. Okay. The second one, after a one-on-one, -on -one, is you can head towards group coaching. Right? You could have a mastermind of maybe 10 people that you coach once a week. Right? Maybe save those people some money that want to get in group coaching and saves you some time. So, building your online business. Who's your niche? This is what you got to think about right away. Who is your niche? Who is your target market or your ideal customer? And then what kind of programs you want to offer? Hey, down below in the links, guess what? I have a link where you can schedule a call with me. How cool is that? And all it does is go to a calendar. You put in your time and we'll connect and um, we'll talk. It's a strategy session. It's not a discovery call or a clarity. It's a strategy session. This is what I'm going to help you with. And I will give you away that free call. It's a $500 call. I'll give it away for nothing. Okay, so the second one, I'm going to have a freebie down below on how you can create a new course. And then I have a freebie for discovering your niche. So you all take care. Hey, schedule a call. Let's get this thing rocking for you. We will talk to you again.